The students at Central High School have quite the unique chemistry program. Hello, I'm Dr. Lou Davis, the chemistry teacher at Central High School. But today, I'm Dr. Death. Students piled into the auditorium to view a show put on by their very own teacher, Dr. Death. Come on, have a seat. Today is a, a day for reward for our, our students in our chemistry classes. We wanted our students to do well. We always want to do well. But all the A, B, and C students doing all the right things were invited to a show today. So I, I take simple little chemical and physics, physical experiments and demonstrate them put a little humor in with it, put a little psychology and play with their minds a little bit with it, and just have a lot of fun. Some of the students were asked to participate in the experiments. He made a girl uh, touch, uh, put her hand in some chemical, and when it was done, she touched a piece of paper, and uh, it seemed like it was blood. <laughs> Chemistry can be a challenging subject, but Dr. Death helps make it fun and interesting. And I'd come in just from the second they walk in the room. I usually have the lights off. I go into this oh, mad man. routine. I play with their minds. I usually have these little cap balls. I'll throw some down on the ground and you know, just play with them. I think that if uh, you don't have an interesting teacher, the kids won't be involved and they won't want to learn what they're doing. And if you're interested, if it makes it interesting, everyone will want to listen and pay attention and actually learn. Some may call him a mad scientist, but all the students seem to enjoy the show. I hope they come back with a, or leave with a better appreciation of what science is. It's not a mystery. There's something behind it. There's facts. And I hope that they leave with an inquiring mind. And when they get that, that, that opens the brain to learning. For more information on this story, visit phoenix.gov slash no99. Reporting for No99, I'm Courtney Olish.